Hello everyone, you are most welcome in today's lesson where we will see how to use cleaning tools, equipment and products. Please take note and be attentive for today. So by starting today, we are going to see how to clean the carpet. We can clean the carpet by vacuuming or by scribing. So now we are going to hoover the carpet by using the hoover or vacuum cleaner. After plugging it there, we have to turn it on using this button here. Then we will use, we, we have to stand behind the space we are cleaning. And for cleaning the corner, because the stick can't clean properly in the corner, we have to remove it from here. And we use the nozzle. Some hoover have the nozzle aside. Others are like this and we just clean on the corner. Now we are going to vacuum the carpet. After vacuuming the carpet, you found that this mark, this heavy dust, can't be moved with the vacuum cleaner. Even this one can't be moved with the vacuum cleaner. That's why we are going to bring the scissor to cut this out, and we will bring the scribing machine to remove all this heavy dust on the carpet. Now we are going to scribe the carpet, particularly to remove this heavy dust. And we will use scribing machine. For using it, you have to take it back like this, slowly, so you can't break it. Then you have to fix the appropriate brush, because as you know, on the first lesson, we mentioned that this machine can be used with different brushes based on the place where we have to clean. So that's why for the carpet, we have to use this type of brush. And you have to take it like this, and you place it, and you close. Then you bring it back slowly. After bring it back, we are going to put in the appropriate cleaning agent, which is carpet shampoo, detergent, and water. For scrubbing the carpet, you have to pay attention on the measurements of the carpet shampoo that you have to put in here. And the measurements differ from the scrubbing machine to another one. So this measurement is for this machine. And now we are going to use three liters of water, and we will put in 30 milliliters of carpet shampoo. We first start with carpet shampoo. Then we add in water. Then we, scrub, we turn on the machine.
Now you see that the stain that was on the carpet, the, the, on the carpets are already off. We can now keep on scrubbing the carpets, the entire carpets, but with the focus of where we have stains. Now we are going to see how we can clean the painted wall. After the painted wall, we will see how to clean the paper wall. Because for the painted wall, you see if I, I try to clean, there are some dust that can't get out that can be removed with the weight cleaning. So we can use the multipurpose cleaner mixed with water. You put it on the cleaning cloth. And you clean, you remove everything. And when you are cleaning, remember that you don't have just to clean the way you want. You have to start from top to bottom. And you have to change on the dry side of the cloth for drying the wall. After cleaning the painted wall, now we can clean the paper wall. Remember that when we are cleaning the paper wall, you don't have to use water. You don't have to use even chemical you have to look a dry cloth, a dry cleaning cloth without any chemical, without any, anything on it. So you just remove like small stain you found on it until it's moved.